everyone. Welcome to a new episode of Thoughts on Education. Today we have Dr. Anuradha Panda, Principal of Lord Jagannath Missions College and School of Nursing. So ma'am, we will start the interview by a small introduction of yours. Thank you so much. Uh, so I am Dr. Anuradha Panda. I am working here as a principal uh, since 2012. So my uh, graduation, like BSc Nursing, I did from College of Nursing, Baranpur, Government College of Nursing in 2001, I passed out. And then I did my master's degree from University College of Nursing, Mangalore. And uh, I have gathered almost 23 years of experience, out of which 13 years of administrative experience uh, in this college as a principal. I also have uh, two years of uh, experience from abroad, like from uh, City University of New York as a research assistant. So uh, I worked in various places, uh, uh, you know, and currently working here as a principal. Okay, and that was great to hear. Mm-hmm. Uh, so, ma'am, my first question to you would be: uh, You have held key positions at education institutes throughout your professional career. So, what are the key factors that keep you connected with the education sector? From the starting of my career, when I started joining in this course, I had a thought of serving the patients. Definitely, I also have gathered few years of uh, experience in clinical sector. But after then, I thought like it's better to educate the students because they were like you know I faced few students those who really I feel felt like they are lacking with knowledge and skill. So uh, then I thought, let me, you know, I upgraded my uh, like uh, education to master's degree. And then I got a chance to work in the uh, college nursing institutions. And uh, since then, I really enjoy, uh, you know, giving, sharing my knowledge and skill with the students. And uh, yes, I believe at some point of time, it's very important, like once the students are well skilled and, you know, thorough with the uh, you know, uh, like uh, curriculum, they will be, uh, you know, uh, you know, better care can be given to the patients. So that's why it's, I felt it's important. To, and I still connected, and I think I'll continue this in the educational sector till the last of my life. Okay, ma'am, that was great. Uh, so, ma'am, my next question to you would be being the principal of uh, this college, what is your philosophy of leadership? How would you describe your leadership style? Uh, well, uh, see, leadership, uh, what I believe is, first thing I believe in myself. I feel like I have the ability, I can manage the affairs, whatever is assigned to me. Until date, I never felt any problem with regard to the management of you know any affair. So, uh, and three things which I believe really is, which is very important when you are, you know, uh, working as a leader. First thing is you must be, uh, you know, a confident uh, must be there within you. Secondly, commitment should be there when you are being, uh, 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 like, you know, given with some responsibility, you must be, account- I mean, uh, you know, you must be committed to that job that will definitely, get, you know, develop your leadership. And uh, yes, compassion should be there. Compassion in the sense that uh, urge to work or you know, you should have that uh, uh, inner urge to complete the assignments or you know, do the task. And moreover, a leader will be called as a leader and when she worked or she or he worked with a group of uh, members, uh, 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 you know, you know well-established team, which I have here. So that's why I believe, you know, I am working as a Till date, as a you know, working my role as a leader in a very proper way. Okay, and that was great to hear. So, ma'am, my next question to you is, like, how does the curriculum of your college ensure the best practices of industry? Well, so as you know, it is a nursing institution. We have a very fixed curriculum which is given by Indian Nursing Council and State Nursing Council. So we abide with the, all the uh, curricular activities which are supposed to be done for the students. And so for that we have a master plan, master rotation plan which we say. We have a clinical rotation plan. So we send the students uh, like you know we arrange for, for their cl- theory classes in the institution. We have lab hours, they go to the laboratory for the you know, various demonstrations 
and after that we send them to the clinicals for their skill and you know practice so that way we you know carry on our plan throughout the year okay ma'am uh, my, my next question is like when you first came to this college what was your vision for the uh, for this college and has it evolved over time and how far along uh, in implementing that vision are you well it's really uh, like you know i feel like uh, a good question uh, thing is uh, my vision to always the nursing profession wherever i was uh, here when i joined i joined as a principal but before i was working as a lecturer so whenever uh, like till uh, beginning i had a vision like i see my profession at the best like I, i always want my students wherever they go they must perform their role in a comprehensive manner in a manner where you know they could able to deliver the care uh, to the best satisfaction of the patients and uh, that was my vision always and i always try my students to uh, do uh, you know to that extent uh, to uh, achieve my expectations and when i joined in this institution actually it was a well developed institution all infrastructure was there but still in some areas i feel there was you know uh, lacunas were there which i tried uh, like you know with uh, uh, our management I, i must mention here that we have a great management whenever i approached with any like you know requirements which is really need for the students for their development they uh have always extended their hand you know great help hand so in that sense uh, we uh, have developed now we could see when i joined we had only 60 students in each courses like bsc glm now we have 125 students bsc glm msc all the uh, courses uh, our seat has been increased and with regard to infrastructure we now we have our own building with all these uh, like uh, laboratories well developed laboratories and uh, you know with regard to faculty also we have a great faculty from various parts of india i must say and also like uh, staff uh, and uh, you know like clinical also like we have our own hospital that's blue hill hospital where the students are getting chance to practice every day so in that scenario i believe at present we have developed a lot you know when i joined and tended within this 12 years of difference we really have developed a lot and at present we are planning to start our phd program also here as i completed my phd and my as vice principal madam also so we are planning to start a phd program here also oh ma'am that was great uh, ma'am my next question is what would you like people to know about your university that they may not know uh, yes so with regard to uh, like uh, our college our institution i tell it is one of the uh, oldest uh, private nursing college we started since 2004 so when it was started uh, our old students they must know what was the you know condition then and what is now we really have developed as i was just telling in all areas so uh, like uh, i will tell students yes if they opt this institution they are going to be, take a very good decision and uh, definitely the uh, faculties who, what we have now it's very different than uh, you know uh, definitely uh, like what is that in a higher position in comparison to uh, you know other institutions i would say so definitely you know when the students are coming they will get uh, you know they definitely will achieve for what they are coming here oh ma'am that was great ma'am my next question is what do you see as the greatest strengths of this college strength the greatest of strengths strength. yeah greatest strength is we have a great number of faculties that's our great strength because oh. we always believe in imparting knowledge to the students and here actually with regard to discipline with regard to administration we are very strict and uh, students also i must thank to my students they always cooperate to me to us like you know to each and every aspect whatever is been given to them whatever is assigned to them they do it very uh, like uh, cooperatively uh, so in that sense our my you know in this institution i'll say the great strength is the our institution at the same time also i will say like i must mention our management our chairman our vice chairman both of them are really uh, very much you know helpful and i'll mention like they have given us freedom 
like they uh, have given that freedom like to take the decisions when and where it is required so that actually helped me and all my team members to walk in a very comfortable zone okay ma'am that was great so ma'am my last question to you would be any suggestions you would like to give to the current youth and the aspiring students yes my suggestion will be my dear students like whenever you are deciding to opt any profession any you know whatever course it may be try to give justice to that course try to give you know do best in that uh, like you know area so that will definitely give you a very separate special recognition because see if uh, there are lot of opportunities are there lot of scope is there at present if i'll tell uh, like a uh, few years back when we see uh, like the profession what it was now and what it is now it is completely different so if you have chosen this profession you have taken a best decision nursing is one of the uh, like uh, uh, noble profession we must say so you have taken the great decision and uh, try to do your best in this area so that like definitely you can create a uh, you know different uh, what is that uh, identification of yourself in this uh, you know society okay ma'am thank you so much ma'am for the wonderful insights and thank you so much ma'am for your time thank you ma'am thank you so much